Hi guys, it's Gabby. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I film videos about my lifestyle, fashion, beauty, and everything in between. So if you like that type of content, then be sure to hit that subscribe button and check out all of my other videos. Today's video, as you guys can see by the title, I am going to be doing a what's in my purse winter edition. I am so excited for this video. You guys have really been loving the what's in my purse videos. If you would like to see the what's in my fall bag video, then I will link that down below. And the what's in my mini bag then I will also link that down below you guys really love those videos so I had to do a what's in my winter bag I hope you guys enjoy and let's get started this is my winter bag of the season I love it so much I basically got a purse from my parents for Christmas and I didn't necessarily love it so I exchanged it for this one so this is the bag that my parents got me or that I technically got myself but I exchanged from the bag that they got me if you would like to see what they got me for Christmas then I will link that video down below you guys can go check that out in my what's I, what I got for Christmas video it was just a green bag it kind of had the same print as this but I didn't like the color I got this one instead and I've been using it ever since this is my winter bag I love it so much it is from Marshall's I believe yeah it's actually an Aldo purse if you guys know TJ Maxx Home Goods, Marshalls, they always sell name brand things for a lot cheaper. They always have some great things there. So this is an Aldo purse. I love it so much. It's actually the only purse that I have from Aldo and I love it. I love how large it is. I think it is so beautiful. It looks like this. It's, I don't even know what color this is. I guess it's kind of like a light green, but it has like this rainbow effect. It's kind of tie-dye and like uh, animal print at the same time. I don't know. It's really weird. I love love it so much. I think it is so unique. You guys know that I love little miniature bags, but I do love a good big bag. And this bag is very large. As you can see, it has a cute little handle and it just looks like this. We have something over here on the back. I don't use this. There's nothing in it, <laughs> but I thought that I would just show it anyways. So this is what the bag looks like. I just think it is so unique and so beautiful, even though it is a very unique bag and it's very different and weird. Um, you can definitely get a lot of use out of it because of the color. I love the handle over here. It's just gold. You open it like so. And then this is what the inside looks like. You have a little compartment here and then it just has the Aldo print all throughout. And then the inside looks like this. So this is my winter bag and let's just get right on into what's inside. So when you open my bag, the first thing that I have in here is a mask. As you can see, it's just a normal ordinary mask that I keep in here just in case. So that is the first thing in my bag. This the second thing that I have in my bag are my car keys. And if you guys watched my last two videos of what's in my bag, I don't think I had my full car keys in here because the bag didn't necessarily fit. But because this bag is very large, it fits my entire car key. So now I can show you guys my real car key set. So this is what I have going on here. This is from Michael Kors. It is just a dark blue wallet set. I love it so much. I got it for Christmas, I think, two or three years ago. I love the color. It's really pretty. Just an ordinary Michael Kors little wallet set. And then you just open it inside. I have some cash in there. I don't have anything in here. Um, no, I don't. And then I just have a bunch of my cards, you know, my license, credit cards, um, everything like that. Obviously, I covered them all so you can't see. But I do have all my cards and money in here. And then over here, I have my car keys, my house keys, keys to my boyfriend's house. And then this is a pepper spray that I got off Amazon. Well, my dad got it for us, for my cousin and I. And yeah, so that is basically all my keys. I'm not going to lie. I kind of don't like that my car keys are attached to my wallet. So I think I'm going to make it so that it's separate. I might have to get like a lanyard or something like that but this is what I use for my keys whenever I have to go out make a purchase or drive a car I use this so that is the next thing in my bag the next thing that I have inside of my bag is a receipt as you can tell I have been using this bag for a while now I mean I haven't gone out recently but I before I was using it like every single day so I have a Kate Spade receipt in here if you guys would like to go see my Kate Spade video then definitely go check that out this was my receipt I got such a good deal you guys I got two bags 
for um, $140, which is insane because the original price was somewhere around $700, which is crazy. So I have a receipt in here. Let's see, the next thing in my bag, I have a little compact mirror. I have two of these. I don't know where I got them from. I mean, I know I got them from Sephora, but I don't know why I got them. I've had them for a while. It's just a black Sephora mirror, and I love it a lot because there's mirrors on both sides. It's a little dirty, um, but as you can see, it just looks like this. I like it a lot because there is it's, it's a fairly large mirror. Usually, like, handheld mirrors are kind of tiny, um, but I like that I can see actually everything, which is insane oh my god I can see my pores yeah I could definitely see everything I really like having this handy in case I need to touch up my makeup this is such a great mirror I kind of forgot about it for a while and then I saw it in my makeup and I was like okay I need to keep this in my bag because the other ones are just not it but this one is really good so I have this in here the next thing in my bag it's like a mystery I, I don't know what's even in here oh, okay next thing I have in here is a little miniature lotion I got this during the holidays I had a coupon from Bath and Body Works it was a uh, get a free $7.99 product so I got a hand cream because you guys know that my hands are literally always so dry this is the fresh sparkling snow ultimate hydration body cream I actually need some right now so I'm gonna apply some it just looks like this it's really cute it just has two mitts on it really cute I'm just gonna apply some on my hands because my hands get so dry during the winter season like it's actually terrible and now I finally have a hand cream so I have been keeping this in here and using it literally every single day because I need it my hands will crack if I do not apply this so this is a must in my winter purse let's see the next thing that I have in my purse are these little mints okay I love these so much so this is the icebreaker sours this reminds me of when I was a kid in Target I don't know why but my family was is or still is obsessed with Target and you guys know when you like go to the register they have like these little things and we would always get them this is they have watermelon green apple tangerine it's amazing oh my gosh they taste so good I can't oh my gosh mm, I can kind of smell them I think my scent is coming back <laughs> so I can kind of smell them I'm not even gonna bother to taste it but they are amazing they're so good I love having them in here for a little nice refresher. I'm not really a big fan of gum, or I like. I like gum, but I'm very picky with gum. So if I'm gonna have like a mint or something, I'd rather it be like sweet flavored, if that makes sense. And something like sugary instead of just like mint. I don't know. I don't like this taste of mint. It just ruins my taste buds. And then I can't eat food because it's like weird. I don't know. I just like something nice and like watermelon or like strawberry, something cute like that. So that's what I have in my bag. The next thing that I have in my purse is my chapstick this is a must especially during the winter this is a must all year round honestly you guys know that i am obsessed with chapstick specifically vaseline i have a huge tub i showed you guys during vlogmas and i absolutely need a vaseline with me at all times it is a good my go-to as you can see it's like practically empty i actually have two of these or technically i have like a bunch of them i have like a car chapstick a purse chapstick a backpack chapstick like an everything chapstick and i have to refill this again but i love it so much i use it 24 7 on my lips it makes my lips feel very hydrated if you have not tried vaseline then you must because it is so amazing so i have this in my purse the next thing i have so many things in my bag oh my God. the next thing that I have in my bag it's actually two things so if I could just grab them are these two hair clips now I actually got these from a package that was sent to me from a hair wand and I have been obsessed with them ever since I got them they are so amazing because they literally just clip onto your hair so good I feel like oh my god <laughs> that was so hard okay you guys this is not how you do it but you get the idea they look like this I love them so much because they're so big and these are the ones that the hair salons use and I love them because again the clips are I like literally ripped out half of my hair the clips are so big they hold so much hair I use them for my makeup all the time and the reason why I have them in my bag is because sometimes when I'm out and about I like to pin my hair back I don't like to put my hair up in ponytails I don't like to put my hair up so the clips are a must I love this I love them so much because you could just pin them like this in the back make it look super cute I want to get one of those um I forgot what they're called but it's like the trend 
trendy ones. I don't want to get them because they're trendy. I just think that they're cute and I haven't worn them in such a long time. So this is instead what I use. I love them and I keep them in my bag. The next thing that I have in my bag is another chapstick. And the only reason why I have this in here is because I keep meaning to leave this in my car. Um, I lied. I do not have a car chapstick because I got rid of it and I need to put it back. So this is my car chapstick that left my car that needs to go back in my car. So I have been keeping it in my purse because I need to put it back in my car. I keep forgetting. Um, this is a uh, it's from Avon. I don't even know how you pronounce it. I think I got this in Portugal. Oh my God, I did. Oh my God, I got this in Portugal years and years ago and I still have it. There's still so much left. It's actually a pretty good chapstick. I got it at Sephora. So I just have it in here, but I need to put it in my car. I have to remember to do that. The last thing in this large part of my bag are the straps to the purse. You guys know that I love holding bags like this. I love just to hold them with my my hand or on my shoulder. I don't like straps. I mean, I like them sometimes, but I don't really use them all the time. So I just always keep them in the bag. So the purse does come with straps. Oh, also I forgot to mention before, but if you would like to purchase this purse, I will link it down below. I think I, there is one very similar to it. I don't think I could find the one exactly like this, but if you like this style, then I will link it down below. It does come with straps. So I just have them in my purse in case I want to use them. So that is everything in the large part of my bag. Bag. Now I'm going to get into what's in this compartment over here. So in here I have a bunch of makeup products. So I'm literally just going to take them all out so we can go through all of them. Okay. Oh my God, I just fell. Hold on. Ah, oh, it literally went underneath my bed. Oh, hold on guys. I have to get like a little miniature pouch to hold products like this because right now I just have them in the small compartment in my purse. But let me show you guys what I have in here. So first things first, I have a spoolie. I have such big brows. I have to constantly shape them up. Even when I'm not wearing makeup, this is like my must have next to my Vaseline. Have to have this with me at all times. And then I also have all of my lip products for when I do have to touch up my lips. So this is a Milani color statement lip liner in the shade 09 Spice. Love it so much. It's from Ulta. And then the lipstick that I like to use is my go-to. I've had it for years now. This is the shade Comet from Morphe, a natural nude lip. Amazing. Love it. I'm wearing it today. I'm actually wearing all the products that I have with me today. I wear it like literally all the time. And then the last one is this new lipstick that I got from Sephora. It actually was a gift given to me. It comes in a little pouch. I'll link it down below. Everything in this bag that I have and that I can find will be linked down below it's really pretty it's like this cute gloss so i have that in here and i think that's everything in my bag i actually think i might have one more thing in here yeah so the last thing i could grab it hold on they're kind of small the last thing that i have in my bag are my earrings i had taken them off and put them in my purse yes so i have my earrings here as you can see they're just like little gold and silver earrings are kind of hard to tell it's kind of hard to tell but um i had them in my ears and i took them off so i put them in my bag so i should probably put that back with my jewelry right now i'm just wearing little hoops and little pink earrings super cute um but that is basically everything in my bag okay you guys that is the end of this video that was everything in my purse i feel like this was a genuine and authentic what's in my bag because um not that the other ones weren't authentic but this is the bag that i have literally been using ever since i got it and i've been stuffing it non-stop so that is literally everything in here i really hope that you guys enjoyed if you would like to check out all of my other videos everything mentioned in this video will be linked down below along with the purses and all of the products i hope you guys enjoyed if you did be sure to give it a big thumbs up comment down below what you thought about it and subscribe to my youtube channel i love you guys and i will see you all in my next video Mwah. bye